Hello, my name is Lauren Izzo, and we are On Record. Romanian Prime Minister Ludovic Orban visited Israel, where he was presented with some of Israel's most advanced military technology by Elbit Systems, including the Hermes 450 unmanned aerial system. Prime Minister Orban was briefed on its special capabilities and how it can contribute to the defense challenges in Romania. The U.S. Army has awarded an enhanced night vision goggles binocular systems contract to Elbit Systems of America. The ENVGB systems provide U.S. warfighters with unprecedented situational awareness during limited visibility conditions and increased mission effectiveness through faster target acquisition. A year-long international research project recently took place in the Arctic Ocean, the first of its kind in 20 years. It was led by the Scripps Institute in California and the Nansen Center of Bergen, Norway. The project was enabled by the deployment of CBAS, a compact, very low-frequency acoustic effector. The system developed by Geospectrum Technologies is programmed to transmit signals under harsh subsea conditions. CBAS sources reception ranges extended across the entire Arctic basin, reaching as far as 2,500 kilometers. The CBAS family of acoustic transducers suits a wide range of subsea applications, including communication or transmission from shore or surface units to submarines, divers alert and communications, communication with unmanned underwater vehicles, mine sweeping and augmentation of submarine signatures when transiting in or out of ports or narrow passages. CBAS configurations vary in size from 20 centimeters up to one meter in diameter. BAE Systems and Elbit Systems of America have teamed up to develop and integrate advanced operational capabilities for combat vehicles. The collaboration is focused on validating and integrating new technologies and multiple mission payloads on combat vehicle systems to deliver advanced warfighting capabilities. With the global pandemic separating us from our loved ones, we have to find creative ways to care for the elderly. Echo is a non-intrusive remote elderly monitor, which has been approved for use in Japan and is being mass produced for the entire Asia Pacific region. The technology is developed by Echo Care Technologies, a portfolio company of Incubit, Elbit Systems Deep Tech Incubator. The radar-based system will be used by elderly care facilities across Japan, Australia, and New Zealand. The system monitors a standard-sized apartment and detects falls, respiratory distress, and even drowning without compromising the individual's privacy. The system continuously monitors and analyzes the person's location, posture, motion, and respiration. A team of engineers from Elbit Systems devised a prosthetic legs release mechanism for a wounded IDF veteran. Enon Cohen is now a teacher who spends most of his working hours standing on prosthetic legs, occasionally having to bend over and release them manually to alleviate the pressure. Having to repeat this action constantly focuses his students' attention to his disability, creating a mental burden for him. The Elbit Systems team created a mechanism allowing him to perform that task with a simple switch of a button on a remote. He no longer needs to bend over and remove the prosthetics. He can do that while still on his feet. The mechanism allows him to go on with his work without the disruption and the mental burden. And that's it for this edition of On Record. I'm Lauren Izzo. Thank you for watching.